These drinks have been the highlight of many people's childhoods. Considered healthy, several health drinks have occupied a permanent space in the kitchen compartments at our homes. But recently, the government has asked e-commerce websites to stop calling these drinks as health drinks, as this category isn't even defined just yet. Allegations in the past have been made on brands like Bone Vita for having too much sugar in their product. Before facing these allegations last year, Bone Vita contained 37.4 grams of sugar for every 100 grams of powder. This was later reduced to 32.2 grams per 100 grams after allegations surfaced on social media. We all know that excessive consumption of sugar can lead to an increased risk of cancer, heart disease and even stroke. According to the National Health Service, an average adult shouldn't have more than 30 grams of free sugar a day, equivalent to 7 cubes of sugar. Furthermore, in children between the ages of 7 to 10, consumption should actually not be exceeding 24 grams, which is 6 cubes. Making children addicted to these amounts of sugar could result in them forming a habit of consuming more and more sugar. Many parents, in fact, use these drinks, such as reward systems, making children consume them after completing their tasks. Remember, a lot of parents also use these powder drinks to in fact get their children to get to drink milk. Now in a situation where the reward itself is harmful, it affects on a child consuming it every day could be extremely adverse. Well, if we leave aside sugar for a second, there are other ingredients as well that could make you seriously unhealthy. Colouring agents, for example. Also, maltodextrin, one of the main ingredients of such drinks, essentially which is a type of a carbohydrate made of corn syrup, potato starch, rice and wheat. If consumed in high amounts, it can cause weight gain, obesity, type 2 diabetes and even high cholesterol. Maltodextrin essentially has no nutritional value. The major reason behind it being used is the fact that it is easily digestive and that it has the ability to give you rapid energy. Now, we're not going to be telling you which brand of powdered drinks you should be consuming. What we will be telling you is that these aren't health drinks. What you can do is that you can read the labels. You can check out the ingredients and sugar content and make an informed choice. You should also be, in fact, ensure that you are helping your child inculcate good eating habits. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today News Mode.